else and that's yeah that's a good bull and he's not broke that bull we might want to shoot just get down there They're It's not a real little bull. That's cows to the right, guys. That's not a bad six point bull. It's a pretty good bull, isn't it? Working across in there right now. Hi, I'm Guy Eastman, and this is Eastman's Hunting TV. On today's episode, we're heading down to Southern Colorado for our yearly excursion with our hunt winner. This year's hunt winner is Ty Johnson from Oregon. We're going to be hunting in October. They're starting to travel around looking for unbred cows and it's a great time to get in on a big bull. Colorado was hit by a big drought this year and so the antler growth isn't quite what it has been the last few years. But these bulls don't know any different. They're charging hard looking for cows. Let's get down there and chase some big bull elk with our 2018 hunt winner. I think this is a 300 if I remember right. Ty, congratulations again for uh being the EBJ hunt winner for 2018. As always, our sponsors came through. Oh, awesome. This is all your stuff, puppy jacket. Probably gonna need this in the mornings. We'll break those things in. We're gonna have a blast. We've heard a ton of stories already. You got to meet the whole crew today. Go out and feel. Sounds like plan. Thank you very much. Tonight. Yeah. here with about 15 cows. He's a cool bull, he's real heavy. He's got uh, double royals, on each, you know, doubles on each side, so he's real thick and heavy. He went around the, cor around the corner on us, but he'll be back in a second. Gonna get a good look at him. There he comes, right there. He's got an extra stick around his 
afraid is Subway. Tip, we switch locations for the evening hunt. Right by the pond rose, and that's Yeah, that's a good bull, and he's not broke. That bull we might want to shoot. Yeah, the one down most broke behind his bull. Let's get down in here. I can see the computer and it's got my ass heavy, heavy. Oh, they're fighting. the ambush and then the wind switched on us and blew them out up the hill so rather monkey with them anymore we're gonna pull out and maybe tomorrow night and let them settle down we're gonna go check some other spots and see if we can find some other bulls
Everybody's disappointed, but uh, it's just how it goes, man. It's elk hunting. Tomorrow's a new day. We'll give her a shot tomorrow. Moments after shooting like passes, we find our target for the morning. He's wide, heavy, the works. Hunt winner, Ty, returns to the meadow in hopes of relocating the bull we had seen last night. Now the guys are trying a little different approach from the top of the canyon where the bull and his cows headed to bed. was not a planned bull, but once we saw him and saw his junk, we knew we had to get him in close. And the kind of terrain we're in, it was gonna happen at 30 yards or less, and we got him at 10. I can't believe it. Look at this bull. Unbelievable. Look at all the extra. I, just can't. I didn't see that front. I didn't see that little kicker up there. I saw the extra kicker up there. I missed that front. Yeah. I did not see that. Yeah. Seven by nine. Seven by nine. And he came probably seven, eight hundred yards right up to us. God, what a great bull. What a great bull. Well, here we are at the end of the road on another hunt winter hunt. This one turned out a little more unexpected than, than most of them. A bull we'd never seen, you guys never seen. 
I guess I was the bad luck charm. I went bear hunting this morning and you guys punched yeah, the tag. That's all it took. <laughs> <laughs> this is just an incredible bull. He's what, seven by nine? And you found one that has not only a lot of points, but isn't broken. Thank goodness, because he had a lot to break. Yeah, a lot. <laughs> <laughs> so we had a great time here in Southern Colorado. Another great hunt, winter hunt. Off on to another adventure. So we hope you enjoyed today's show. Remember, fair chase is the only way to hunt and take trophy big game. We'll see you next week right here on Eastman's Hunting TV.